Story of the Baby Bison. Whee! Come on, Lucy. Hmm. Ah. What are you doing, Lucy? I'm looking for clues. I'm a detective, you see. I solve mysteries. That's why I need a magnifying glass. Can I try, Lucy? <laughs> Lucy, I know a good mystery story. Would you like to hear it? Yes, please, Boris. It was spring in the forest. And the last of the winter snow was melting. This is so much fun, Charlie. <laughs> yes, Alfie. Share the snow's melting. There's just enough left for one last snowboard. Look. What's that? It was a strange, brown, woolly creature. <laughs> Alfie and Charlie had never seen anything like it. But we catch butterfly. Yippity, yippity, yippity. Oh. 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 Ouch! <laughs> oh, poor thing. <laughs> Hello? Barbara hurt head. Here, this will make it better. I'm Alfie. And I'm Charlie. My name is Barbara Bison. We're Mama and Papa. I think you've got lost, Barbara. I was only trying to catch butterfly. <laughs> don't cry. We'll take you home to your Mama and Papa. But I don't know which way is home. Just leave it to us. Alfie and Charlie. Chipmunk detectives. Hi, ho! First, we need a clue. Barbara, is there anything you can remember about your home? Um, yes, blubbly water. Blubbly water? Ah, oh, bubbly water. Follow me. And so, Charlie and Alfie led Barbara to the river, which was full of bubbly water. Yippity, 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 yay! Yippity, 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 yo! Yippity, yippity, yay! Yippity, 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 yippity! Yippity, 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 yay! Barbara catch fishes! One happy baby bison! Where, Mama, Papa? This not Barbara's home. Oh! <laughs> not to worry, Barbara. We'll find your home. All we need is another clue. Try to think. Can you remember anything else about your home? <gasps> yes. Yellow flowers. Ah! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Then... 
to the right. This time, Alfie and Charlie took Barbara to the meadow. It was filled with yellow flowers. Oh, so pretty. Yippity, yippity. Oh. Barbara was having heaps of fun. But then... Hmm. Barbara not like me. Barbara's little flowers. That not Barbara's home. Well, we can't be far from your home, Barbara. Try to think of one more clue. Let me grass. Straight ahead! Alfie and Charlie took Barbara deep into the forest. Here we are! Yummy grass! But what about Boris? Oh, 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 oh that tickles. Oh, oh, stop it. Oh, hey, that's my bed. Oh, sorry. Oh, hi, Boris. Um, we're looking for Barbara's home. It's got bubbly water and yellow flowers and yummy grass. Well, this can't be Barbara's home because this is absolutely, most definitely, and completely my home. Oh. 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 <laughs> mm, why don't you try that way, over the hill? Barbara never see home again. Oh. Cheer up, Barbara. Remember, you've got Alfie and Charlie. Chipmunk detectives never give up. All we need is just one last clue. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> oh. Where's Fluffy's seeds? Yippee-dee! Barbara and the chipmunks had reached the top of the hill. And they saw yummy grass, yellow flowers, bubbly water, and many, many bison. Barbara! Mama! Papa! Everywhere looking for you. Sorry, Mama, Papa. Papa wanted to catch butterfly. Next time you see a butterfly, we'll chase it together, honey. Okay, Mama. Oh. <laughs> oh. Thank you for bringing our Barbara home, boys. Another mystery solved by Alfie and Charlie, Chipmunk Detectives. That's how the baby bison got back home to her family. What a brilliant story, Boris. Now I need a mystery to solve. Oh dear, Nelson has disappeared. This is a case for Detective Lucy. Hmm. 
<laughs> Very clever, Lucy. And now, time for bed. <sighs> Good night, everyone. Sweet dreams. Scores of the Boomerang Ball Game. It's a football. Ah, uh, no, Molly. I think you are mistaken. This is a basketball. Oh, <laughs> no, it's a circus ball. Whee! Whoops. No, no, no. I think you'll find what we have here is a golf ball. <laughs> well, an elephant-sized one. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many games you can play with just one ball. That's right, Lucy. Oh, hello, Wooly. But I think I know a game you've never heard of. That sounds like a story. Yes. Let me tell you the story of the boomerang ball game. Joey the kangaroo and his friends loved playing boomerang ball. And their mums loved watching them play. Ready, Joey? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Short. You're right there, Janet, but just you watch. My Jimmy's getting into his stride now. Woohoo! What? That's the way, son. Joey never misses two shots in a row. He's such a little star. So's my Jimmy. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. I don't think he was ready, and there's no need to laugh, Julie. We all know my Joey's the best player out there. I don't know which game you've been watching, Janet, but my Jimmy is a much better player than Joey. <laughs> well played, Jimmy. Ball's a game. You played great too, Joey. Want to play a game tomorrow? Too right, I do. Mum, can we play again tomorrow, please? Sorry, sweetie. I don't think there'll be any more games for a while. But no buts. Home time. There were no more games of boomerang ball all week. Ah, uh, it just isn't fair, Carrie. Mum won't take me to play boomerang ball with Jimmy and the others. So, why don't you go there on your own? Ah, uh, it's too far away, and it would be no fun playing on my own. <laughs> oh. I wish there was some way to let Jimmy know I'm missing our games together. No problem. I can tell him. <sighs> good day, Jimmy. <sighs> no, it's not a good day, Kerry. I bought you a message from Joey. Really? Yeah, he says he wishes you could play boomerang ball together again. Ah, oh, me too. You two need to get your mums talking to each other again. <gasps> I have an idea. If you take these flowers to Joey's mum, I'll write a note pretending they're from my mum. Good plan, Jimmy. It was hot and windy as Carrie flew back to Joey's home. <laughs> What's this? Some scruffy old weeds and a note. To Janet, from your good friend, Julie. What have you got there, Mum? A bunch of floppy weeds from your friend's mum. 
Jimmy sent those flowers to try and get your mums talking to each other again. Mm, it didn't work. We need to try again. This painting will make a bonzer gift for Jimmy's mum. Carrie flew straight back to Jimmy's home. She hoped this plan would work better than the last one. <laughs> From your good friend, Janet. What a horrible mess. Hi, Mum. What have you got there? A messy painting from your friend's mum. <sighs> Nothing we do is working, Carrie. I don't think our mums are ever going to be friends again. Wait up, Jimmy. I reckon I've got an idea. Snack, please. A nice yum tum leaf sarnie. Sure, son. I think we can manage that. Ah, oh, it looks like we're out of yum tum leaves. Would you like something else instead? Ah. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess I can hop out and pick some fresh. These will do nicely. Jimmy's mum had just started picking yum tum leaves when she heard a familiar voice. Yes, young Jimmy is a lovely young kangaroo. Joe's mum talking about my Jimmy? But it wasn't Joey's mum, it was Carrie pretending to be Joey's mum. And he's so good at boomerang ball. It's really nice of Janet to say that. I do miss chatting to her. <sighs> that Joey is such a fussy eater, insisting on boomeroo berries for his lunch when we don't have any. Oh no! The best boomerang ball player by far is Joey. Joey's mum heard a familiar voice too. It was Carrie pretending to be Jimmy's mum. He and my Jimmy used to have so much fun playing together. They did have good times together. And I miss chatting to Julie. As the day came to a close, Joey's mum was still thinking about what she'd overheard. Good night, sweetie. I just need to hop out for a while, but I'll be right back. OK, mum. <sighs> the next day, Joey woke up early. Morning, Mum. What are you doing? I'm packing a picnic. Bonza! Where are we going? To the boomerang ball ground. Yay! Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, oh, uh, uh, will Jimmy be coming too? He sure will. Julie and I have had a little chat and decided it was high time we made up. <laughs> Jimmy is in great form today, Julie. So's your Joey, Janet. <laughs> the two mums agreed. It was such a joy to see their youngsters play boomerang ball, they wouldn't miss it for the world. Thanks for the story, Wooly. Oh, mm, it was my pleasure. I'm going to teach all my friends at school how to play boomerang ball. But right now, 
it's time for bed. Good night, everyone. Good night, Lucy.